Hello and welcome to Let's Talk Sport on YouTube. And today with Jamie Davis and Joe Stanley, we are going to be previewing the Masters Golf 2018, the first major of the calendar. I can't wait. Joe certainly can't wait. And it's, it's funny, Joe, it's one of those competitions where, I mean, I'm not saying I'm not a golf fan, but I mean, you, you're a big football fan, but... The Masters is one of those where in in England we get to watch it for free on the BBC. It's great for us, but it's just the the venue, Augusta, the the the, the, the tradition and the atmosphere and and just the whole excitement of it just makes you really geared up to to watch a, a very good showdown on Sunday. Oh, it's, it's always exciting when the the Masters comes around. Everyone worldwide tunes in to watch it. Yeah, it's a historic course. You've got Amen Corner, is it you called? Have, yeah, Amen Corner, Amen Corner, Corner which is very famous. Obviously, costs a lot of money to go there, so. <laughs> It's just a pipe dream for me. But I was going to say, how much did you find out the other day? A weekly pass is seven grand this year, and a day pass is three grand. It's double the fees of last year, and those fees could rise due to high demand. So, it's not cheap. It's not no, it is not cheap. Um, and obviously, this is the first major uh, of the season. So this this is very well open. On, de depending on how the tours has been going out in the European tour and the PGA tour. We found out that the favourite is Rory McIlroy. Now, of course, Rory McIlroy is known for what happened in 2011 where he was leading on the final day and it literally just went downhill. He was even hitting the ball out of the park uh, near one of the buildings. It got that bad in his rounds uh, of, of the Masters of 2011. And since then, he hasn't, he hasn't really recovered in Augusta. He's never gone close to getting that green jacket. It's the only major he's not won. And if he wins that, Joe, he goes down with the likes of Tiger Woods, Arnold Palmer, you name it, to have won every major in the uh, golf stage. Yeah, it's, it's a shame that he didn't win it in 2011. He deserved it. I thought he was destined, but obviously, as you said, the last round. This year might be a different story. We never know with Rory McIlroy. Last year, he was there thereabouts on the second round and then faded away again. So we don't know what's going to happen. Hopefully, from a British point of view, he'll do well. And I quite like Rory McIlroy. Justin Rose is my favourite player, but mm. Rory McIlroy is up there in the top five for me. And... Obviously, you want Rory McIlroy to do well to make it a, an interesting Masters. You want an exciting Masters. You want the best players like Tiger Woods, Rory McIlroy, Spieth and Johnson all targeting and all going for the competing for the title. You want people winning the green jacket and Rory McIlroy is one of these legends that you want to win the green jacket. And, and you mentioned Tiger Woods. He's back on the scene. Um, it's taken a, a fair while um, for him to return on the golf scene, but he's progressed really well since he's come back over the last few weeks. Can he do it? Can he win his first major since the US Open in 2008? There's always a chance for Tiger. You can never write Tiger off, except from, I have to be honest, I told my hands up and say a couple of years ago I thought he was done with his back injuries. I thought this is a sad end for the Tiger, but he's come back. He's proven us all wrong, and gladly so. I think he'll be up there competing. I don't think he'll win it this year, but I do think he'll be in contention. Uh, well, well, we'll find out. Hopefully he does well. He is up there in the bookies list. I believe he is, uh, is he second favourite? We're checking our notes here. Uh, I don't think he's on there. Third, third favourite, yeah, you've got obviously Johnson, Spieth and Thomas all at 10 to 1 joint second favourite. So Tag Woods is 11 to 1 third favourite. So, well, interesting lineup, isn't it? You know, with all those plays ahead of Tiger Woods, it just shows that time has changed. Anyway, Joe, before we finish off this preview, who are you going to go for? Name the player you think is going to win the Masters of 2018. Well, he comes second last year, and I think he will, oh. he could do well this year. Is Justin Rose, but a wild card guess. I wouldn't rule out Martin Keimer because he's mm. he's always does well at the Masters. He's always in the mix. So Martin Keimer is one that I've got a feeling might do well, might be in the top ten on the table. But I've got a feeling Rose might do it this year. Well, it looks like it could be Justin Rose, according to Joe Stanley. Do you agree, or could it be someone else? Could it be Tiger Woods? Could it be Sergio Garcia again from last year? We want to hear your views. Comment below on this video. Go with who you think is going to win, and we'll share it on our Let's Talk Sport show. So thank you very much for watching. Subscribe to Let's Talk Sport for more videos, and thank you for watching.